guess what, guys? I've got a story from my from my real life. Do you want an oh. intro for that too? Well, not that. Sh- no, oh, but that's not a story fitting. Story from Kate's life. But that is not fitting for this story because this could oh. quite possibly be the most disgusting thing that has ever happened to me in my whole life. Meanwhile, oh. you're, you're telling your story with your foot raised with an ice pack on it. I mean, <laughs> a bit of a martyr. Yeah. No, well, I'm trying to be quiet about it, but I can't tell you how much my foot is throbbing well, right you certainly, now. You've told us a lot, so I don't know why you're saying you can't tell us. <laughs> I know you're trying to be quiet. I'd love to hear what you, do, what you sound like when you're trying to be loud. <laughs> well, I've had some medication. All I need is a scotch and to go home early and I'll yeah. be fine. If this isn't the story you're about to tell. This isn't the same one you just told us about your mum, is it? <laughs> I never tell stories about my family. I mean, you're really hitting us with some zingers to start the week off. <laughs> I, I, I did not expect to do a couple of these on Monday. That's all. Oh my goodness! Okay. I've never used had to use the uh, the car crash sound <laughs> off air before. <laughs> Well, I certainly have to before. Okay, wait for this. This is right. repulsive, and I, 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 I urge you to tell me if you would be coping so well with a Monday if this happened to you. Okay. I decide to go to the gym this morning. I don't yeah. have a car, which is really annoying to Were start Were you wearing with. underpants? Because yes. traditionally you don't. Well, not full underpants, but a G-string under Ooh, my tights. Yes, just... I did. Oh, hang on. And I'm I have to do that now. Not to think about that. Because after I shared the story about... perfect steak all of so. Maybe <laughs> not wearing pants under my tights. I feel yeah. completely self-conscious about what Good. people are thinking of me when they see me in my tights. So I go to the gym. I do an hour on the treadmill and listen to the worst podcast that Marty Sheargold has told me to. Yep, awful. I'm going to have to find a new one. Or Who was the killer? Oh, that's right. You'll never know. You'll never know. <laughs> no one knows. Good podcast. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, I come out of the gym and I realise it's kind of late and I haven't done all of the work that I would usually need to do for our on-air content. What do you mean? The beast that is radio and all that rubbish that we go on about. Well, finding stories, trawling the internet for witty, you know, funny kind of anecdotes. Yep. Yep. The Oscars are on, trying to stay on top of that. So you panicked. So I think, you know what? I've got to walk home from the gym. Mm. It might take me up to half an hour to get home on because I've got to go via shops on the way. Oh, God. So well, maybe is it, is I should just shush. anything happening in this story? Just shush. The news is about to. <laughs> so, <laughs> we know why people listen to the radio. Well, that's in my traffic and news. I mean, where does Villa? <laughs> well, let me finish it. Let me finish it. So I think I'm going to get a coffee yeah. and I'm going to find somewhere nice to sit quietly. The sunshine is out and I'll finish my work before I walk home for half an hour, right? Nice. Because that Good might idea. be too late. Yeah. So I get a little coffee. I've got my shopping. I find a park bench to sit on. I sit yeah. on the park bench. I'm engrossed, right, mm. in, in my phone, mm. you know, trawling through things, yeah, yep. trying mm. to find the best yeah. stories. Mm. Shut up. <laughs> just let me tell my story. Well, it's just a pace issue now. No. I think, you know what I need? I need a sip of my coffee. Good. So I pick the coffee up mm. and I have take a big swig and I think, oh, that is like ice cold. Mm. This coffee is ice cold mm. and it's a lot more sugary than a coffee that I would <laughs> usually don't, get. Don't tell me that you've picked up a stranger's coffee. Yes, I sip. picked up a homeless person's <laughs> coffee. Maybe not a homeless person. Maybe just someone who was waiting for the bus this morning and, and left you, a cup of coffee you, there. You oh, drank no. their coffee. I drank... Oh, the, oh, that's the photo over <laughs> there. Oh, my God. And Where I, was your coffee? Why did you drink their coffee? I don't understand. Mine was sitting up because I'd put my shopping down. I'd put it up on mm. the stone on the um, the stone wall that was sitting bes- I've behind. I've got to say, it looks like a really nice spot to relax with a cup of joe. <laughs> well, I was right, in right panic. by the bin there. <laughs> What are you, an ibis? <laughs> I mean, of all the spots to stop, you had to I sit did. on the bin. I, mean, I was in a panic. But well, also, you could bang through who touched you on the bum before. <laughs> Don't worry, I hate my life too. Oh, no, I'm it's in, a cracker. Oh, I know. I, I you did, drank a I strange, random coffee. So I had coffee. this cold, sugary syrup in my mouth. Oh, I stood up God. over that bin that you can see in yeah. the photo, and I didn't spit the coffee out. I yeah. just. Open my mouth and let it fall out. Fall let out. it fall out into the bin, <laughs> hoping that no one was looking at me. And and God forbid they yeah. saw me spit, or yeah. let alone think I was peering into the bin looking for yeah. a burger. Oh God, Kate Richie's vomiting in a bin and eating something. <laughs> I thought it. she got paid well doing radio. <laughs> oh, she does. Don't worry. That is you, the most worry. disgusting <laughs> thing I've ever had in my <laughs> mouth. Or oh, sorry, no, drank. I find that hard oh, to drank. believe. Mark. I find that hard to believe. <laughs> Oh, oh dear! Oh my God! It was one of the lowest of the low points and in my totally life. And you were totally sober this morning doing that. Yeah, I was. 
Because mm. I remember at a music festival once I picked up uh, the wrong can. It was a can of UDL. Mm. It's only half filled and oh. warm and it had so many cigarette butts. <laughs> 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 Oh. At least they were just cigarettes. I mean, I don't know who's oh, sorry, mouth I was around. Oh, sorry, you in. Nah, you in. Yeah. 